Okay, I've just got off to the pothole demonstration. Potholes make Glasgow at George Square today. Um, gonna film a little bit of it and hopefully get some people to speak and let the council and whoever are in charge let them know what they what we think of the place. See if we can get some of these poles sorted and some action done. Right, see you there. Oh yeah, right, I'm at George Square. There's the city chambers. Let's go and see what's going on here. So here we are, Paul's mate Glasgow. Ridiculous, absolutely ridiculous. You can't go anywhere without potholes. What? I've ordered a bit of them, have a bit of a bit of no claims bonus by having to pay for two new alloys. So I my tap my insurance will be up. So sick of it. Sick of it. Uh, sick of it. It's cost me hundred and eighty pounds to get a new bar put across the back of the car through a pothole. Ah, that's right. It's ridiculous. And tires have been down all the time. Oh, it's dangerous. Yeah, it's dangerous. She's had the bloody tire service is out to tell us how this much is they're making just now. Safety, because you've oh, not got geez. time to look at all the potholes and all the signs that's out now and all the oh, white, oh, white oh, lines on it.
let's do this. Susan Aitken, we demand better roads. Come on, everybody, let's get the homes going. Come on. Right, so I've just been filming the protests and now I'm driving around joining the taxi drivers. We're protesting about the state of these roads. It's worse than a third world country. It's terrible. Yeah, so we're just driving around. Late the council door, just got past the council building here where they spend millions of pounds on luck and can't even fix a road. And it's dangerous. I've got to concentrate, I'm meant to be concentrating on my job. Safety, health and safety, picking up passengers, safety, but instead, something up here. Instead, I've got to concentrate on the flipping potholes in the road. I mean, what happens if an ambulance come, come across and bang down the hole? There's a passenger in it. Shocking. Anyway, let's get back to the, the demonstration. Yes. I'm up from London. Are you guys paying tax for your roads? Yes, we are. 
Go and join them. Go, go, and, go and tell them. You better be back. I'm lost. I've been here three times. I can't find George Square. No, I've no idea where it is myself. I'm lost. <laughs> Keep going round. Get me in. Yeah, get you in. Have you got anything to say? My picture is enough to be on the poster. All right. <laughs> An absolute disgrace, Glasgow City Council, get your act together. It's, you're an absolute disgrace, get your act together and get these potholes fixed. I had a brand new car, it was only 450 miles, I needed to, went into a pothole, burst it. My son-in-law was £240 yesterday, an absolute disgrace. And I don't think they're going to do anything to somebody gets killed. Exactly, really somebody's honest. going to end up getting killed. Something's going to happen, shocking, some disaster. Absolutely shocking. Yeah, it's an absolute disgrace not to get the roads fixed, especially the amount of money they take in every year off our small I think uh, it's been a good enough turnout. I think the taxi drivers have done amazing today and I hope that there'll be more support coming up because at the end of the day, Glasgow City, its roads are crumbling and it's time that we all stood up and got this fixed. The Glasgow City Council needs to be held accountable. So let's hope that potholes don't make Glasgow much longer. Thank you. All right, any words? Anything to say? No, no, just to, fix the roads. To the council, not to me. I'm no, not, it's no, not me fixing the, the roads. roads. <laughs> I don't think you're driving on. <laughs> I don't. Baldy vlogger. Yes. Hello, hang I'm hang Alison. On. Hello, Alison. How are you? Do you want to say something? Anything to say, anyone? Any messages to the There's council? The budget, the budget, the budget, the budget. Without swearing. Get your fingers out. You're really messages. Okay. I don't want us to drive. That, that's, that's, it. that's the bottom line. They want to have 15 minutes. We have a right to drive. 15 minutes from your house. Yeah. We don't exactly. want you to go any further. No. We have a right to drive. We have freedom. We do. You know. Well, every country I go to, the roads are better than here. They are. But I'm uh, talking to I'm a not guy, joking. A guy well, from are. Birmingham. He says, "Come down and fight us. Come down and support us because Birmingham. A girl from Edinburgh. Come through to Edinburgh. Our roads are terrible. So it's not just here. It's it seems to be a government. It's, well, it's Britain. I mean, it no, is Britain. Part of their plan. Uh huh. Yeah. To lock the 15 minutes. Yeah. That's right. Be careful. Watch out for the potholes.